Monday morning and I'm feeding the koi outside and we'll go inside and look at the fish. Wow, that lettuce really took over in here. But yeah, uh, <laughs> the video is going to be late. I had no way here yesterday. I'm down to one car again. My mechanic didn't do a good job on that exhaust. Uh, it fell off within 24 hours of uh, putting it on. I don't know what's going on. <clears throat> I need a new mechanic. I need a new car. Can't afford it right now. But I wasn't able to get here. I talked to Rich, so I'm here this morning early. And I'm going to hurry up and do a video. Unlike his house, my internet is pretty good. So I should be able to get home and get this out by ooh, 11 o'clock noon at the latest. I apologize, but at least I will get something out for you guys. Uh, again, I'm just going to go through the fish room. We'll see all the fishies and how they're doing and so forth so on. But there's some things that have been going on, but I can't show you, unfortunately. But wait till Josh's next video. I think tomorrow. You guys are going to love it. It is spectacular. All right, let's go in. I got to turn the lights on and everything, feed some fish. And I brought some food for the turtles. Dawn made some uh, eggs and um, blackberries or blueberries or something like that and so forth for the turtles. So I'm going to feed them as well. Brutus got out. Uh, they left the pump on a little bit, so it's a little low. And Brutus got out. He's on the other side again. But this guy's doing just fine, I guess. So nobody's messing with him. And that's just great. In fact, the cars are over here, and he seems to be just fine. No new marks or anything like that. Awesome. That's good to know. And the salt water tank, it's doing really good. Back next time I'll use that polarized thing that used to be out here, but everything's been getting moved around, so I'm not sure where it is. And I don't see Mr. Eel this morning, so he's out and about. But, yep, looking good. Alright, the Stingray tank. There's Hubert. And obviously we lost that other fish, as I showed a couple videos ago. That does happen. And there is the angel tank, doing good. Yeah, I love that black one, man. These things are so cool looking. Reminds me of that plant Don has, that medic out of the legs plant, the way it's uh, thins up. And of course the discus tank. Ooh, are those eggs on there? I wonder, I'll have to point that out to Rich, but it looks like it. Oh, string algae, I hate it. Look at these guys. Yeah, everybody there. <laughs> Which is, I don't know if we're just fed them yet this morning or not. And now the whole tank's open again, huh? Datnoid, Mr. Datnoid, buddy. Oh, I forget what he is. It's starting to get pretty good. In fact, Rich is going to test me here in the next week on how well I'm getting to know these fish now. Has been a while, but. Yep, I'm starting to, man, these cats are getting as big as the Adonis Pleco now. They have really, really grown. And of course the rays, baby ray. Beavis and Butthead, that is so cool. Kurt was a fan of Beavis and Butthead growing up and that, he got kind of stupid with his underwear and all that like the one of them does. I watched it once or twice. I know he... Had to stop making him watch it for a while when he was young, but <laughs> he thought he got a kick out of them being called Beavis and Butthead. And he's starting to eat again. Look at the teeth on that guy. Wow, you can really see the teeth. Let's see if I can. Come on, buddy. Yeah, look at them teeth. I wish this thing would focus a little better. Boy, oh boy, I never really noticed them before, but it's starting to grow and you can start to see them teeth. That is cool. I never really noticed them before. Yeah, we gotta get the light fixed on this. Since I have, I have no time right now, I 
I used to be here three, four times a week and quite a bit, and now I'm like hardly being able to get over here and get a video done right now. I'm having so much trouble with these stupid cars. Uh, not a whole lot I can do about it, neither. Well, one thing after another. Yeah. What's up, Pancake? How you doing? Looks like half these guys are still asleep. <laughs> I just did turn the lights on for everybody. How you doing, buddy? What you doing? You like your new home in here, huh? Yeah. What's up, buddy? You gonna come say hi? Huh? Yeah. Oh, a lot of them come and say hi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what's up, buddy? What's up, Schwarzenegger? You old son of a gun. I think he's the oldest fish Big Rich has, that Rich has had since it's been a small little fry. Yeah. Thousand. Oh, I didn't know they put a draft cat in there. Okay. Yeah, I'm doing good. I forget the name of this one. Darn it. Yeah, I gotta remember. What's up, girl? How you doing, Lavaca? What's up, honey boy? Plants in your tank are starting to really take off, girl. Good. Yeah. Okay. And <laughs> look at Tesla. <laughs> He's like wrapped into his uh, ships there. That's kind of cool. Look at that. <laughs> Okay. Oh, we got some new fish in here. I'm not sure what he is, but he looks neat. Oh, he's an arowana of some sort. Okay, he's just part. Arowana. Some Oscars in there, a red tail in there. It looks like four Oscars maybe in there. Here at Pucko. Mmm, three red tails in this one, it looks like. Something else in the corner can't quite make him out. But there's at least three red tails in there. Ah, the light didn't come on in the Abba Abba tank. Or the Cichlid tank, and I'm not sure why. But, well, he was out the light on. It's still can see him pretty good with your camera. Not bad. Now we still got one, two, three, five fish in here. All those guys are gone. There's that little barracuda, I believe. I believe that's what he is, little barracuda, two of them. They're still in quarantine. We got these guys. Where are they? More cichlids? Not sure. Ah, there's a tank gone, so I'm going to be doing some moving around. The Dorados and the Baby Rays. And yep, they're eating. They're doing good. <laughs> and the Sturgeon, of course. He's doing just fine. He's kind of cool. They're so sleek looking. Okay. All right, let's go look at the rest of them. Oh, I forgot to go get my food. Let me go get the food for the turtles. Oh no, I was just walking by and look at this guy. I'm not sure where he came from, but there's a turtle. And a new tank, so somebody brought, oh. <laughs> and another turtle, <laughs> and another tank right next to him. This is right under the uh, community tank here. Yeah, just walked in and there they are. 
I thought they were empty tanks that somebody brought, but no, they're not empty. A couple box turtles, it looks like maybe. He's a pretty good sized one there. Uh, what's up, buddy? That's a nice claw out of here, man. Look at them taking suckers. Okay. Then let me run out to the car and get the turtle food real quick. Boy, I come over to start sweeping off and they go crazy. In fact, Chomper almost walked over off a little foot. I couldn't find no lettuce. I think he's out. I didn't bring any out. I'll put some hay in here and I'll put the what Don brought. Some little treats for him. But I'll give him a little something here. Okay. Little foot. Yeah, you know what to do, buddy, don't you? <laughs> now I'll put all this in here. <laughs> Look, I'm just pushing them over, man. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, a little bit like, yeah, that tastes good. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah, chump are going for the egg. Oh, that tastes good. Thank you, Don. Hey, you're welcome. He's trying to get it off his nose and stuff his nose. I don't know if you guys saw that. Oh, that was funny. It stuck to his nose and he was trying to get it off. <laughs> well, he really likes some eggs, man. Look at him chump. Well, now we know why you're called chumper, huh? Look, he's just pushing his little foot right out of the way. Come on, Chomper, be nice. Put a little foot in there. Wow, Chomper is just tearing it up, man. Oh, I think he, I think he bit his foot. <laughs> Look at him go. <laughs> That's cool. I love feeding these guys. Yeah, give him a nice little treat. Alright. That one more little piece of egg in there. Go chopper. Alright. <clears throat> okay. That's a long day. Boy, everybody pretty active this morning too. Yeah. What's up, big boy? What's up, big guy? Alrighty. So I think I got enough for a video for today. These guys are just going nuts, oh. Look at that, see that? He got it stuck to his face again. <laughs> That's alright, he knows what to do. He's using his claws and his paws and getting it off. Yep. Good stuff, huh, guys? Glad you enjoyed it. All right. Yeah, I wish I could stick around and do more, but I gotta get back home. Gotta try and get a hold of this stupid mechanic and see about getting my dang car fixed already. Oh, all right. So, uh, I'll get out of here and get home and get this thing posted real quick so you guys got a video at least. See what's happening there's a lot going on but i can't say anything some really cool stuff but you'll have to wait to see the next videos all right so uh i'll catch you guys on the flip side all right hope you enjoyed this quick little video hey, you heard what's going on i already called my mechanic i'm just waiting to hear from him so i can get this car fixed so i can you know get things done and get back on the road again uh Hoover and Rich, they did an awesome haul the other day, and hopefully I'm, they did some video. They did call me and ask me to come down, and I could have got a video of it, but I didn't have a ride, so I missed out on that, and I didn't take any film of the trailer or the truck or anything because, again, I don't know if Rich has done that or not, and he was busy, so I couldn't talk to him. 
so we'll <laughs> we'll just have to you know take one step at a time here just trying to get everything taken care of so we can get back on the road and take care of things here all right so you guys you hit that like subscribe and uh, share and we'll go deeper with a reaper